Good evening once again, ladies and gents. Yep, this is Zan Da Sportsman TV. Yes, coming to next week's... No, sorry, not next week, the week after. On May the 1st, the main event. Derek Delboy Chisora versus Joseph Parker. Looking forward to that fight. I can't not wait. Yeah, Joseph Parker... Um, recently fought um, f a fellow compatriot by the name of Junior Far. Um, he won that. Um, I think it was by the unanimous decision. Didn't even get a chance to do um, post fight coverage for that fight, but um, he got the job done. Yeah, ever since um he was WBO world champion and he lost his um championship belt. Um. I haven't seen much from Joseph Parker. Yep, he has lost to Dylan White and so on, but um, his um career hasn't um gone so steadily ever since. Yep, um, I think it was just a very early hot prospect, and um, his um career just hasn't quite gone to plan ever since. Yeah, he's still young, so um, still got a few years left in him, but you just never know. Yep, um, he might go on a winning streak. Um, who knows? But um, coming to Delbo um Chisora, yep, he managed to change his career around ever since he beat Carlos Takam. He's he's gone on a decent run. Well, fair enough. He did lose to Dylan White for the second time, and um, Alexander Usyk. A lot of people um said he was going to get knocked out. Usyk was going to outclass him, but he he fought pretty well in that fight to be honest with you I was very impressed with him landed some meaty shots on Usyk but Usyk was just a bit um too quick and technical for him on the night um I was a bit surprised um he didn't get the decision because he did hurt Usyk and he did pressure him but um it just wasn't meant to be Usyk is just a good quality fighter he lacks the heavyweight power but very skillful yeah, but it just wasn't meant to be. So no disgrace to Delboy losing to Alexander Usyk on um, points decision. Yeah. Um, yeah, so ever since the um, Carlos Takam victory, um, he's changed trainer and um, he's, he's turned his career around and um, beat David Price. Um had a f amazing um, knockout victory back in 2019 against Arta Splitka. Um, it took Deontay Wilder, I think it was nine or ten rounds, to knock out Splitka. Uh, Chisora only did it in two rounds, can you believe? I was at that uh, fight as well. Yeah, but obviously I couldn't film it due to copyright reasons. Yep, in, at the O2 Arena. Yep, um... Well, left hook, um, left split cut out of his, his devices. Yep, so Derek Chisora has gone on um, a winning run. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if he beat Joseph Parker. Um, if Joseph Parker loses his fight, maybe he's not the end of the world. He's still quite young, but um, we have to see what happens based on his performance on, on, on the fight. But um, it's going to be a good fight, but I, I think um, Chisora will... Um, win, win. Um, by a split decision, in my opinion, but he has to be in um top shape to win this one. Yep, and um, stay motivated. Yeah, man. Um, yeah. In in the last recent fights, uh, I've noticed Derek Chisora means business. Um, yeah, his his new um. Yep, his new logo. Yeah, war. Yeah, on on um his um merchandise, yeah. So I mean that says everything. He's he's he looks the part now. Yeah, he's a totally different fighter ever since he left John. Um, sorry, Don Charles. Yeah, man, and he's been um I noticed um in his previous training camp, um, he's been having some good tear ups in sparring sessions with Brian Jennings. So uh, he he has a different mentality. He's a totally different fighter now um since um his first defeat to dealing white um he's he's just has a total different mentality 
yeah but however this is heavyweight boxing anything can happen um i'm i'm wishing Derek chisora well but um if Derek chisora does win Hopefully, you can get a shot at the world title. Hopefully, hopefully, who knows? Yeah, man, that will be very good if it happens. But at least the good thing you can say about Derek Chisora, he never backs down from a fight. He never backs away from a fight. Any man you put in front of him, he, um, yep, any man you put in front of him, he's willing to take the fight. Yeah, man, but, um, for Joseph Parker, have we seen. Um, the best of him. Um, can he reignite the old flames? Who knows? Yep. Yeah, um, we we'll probably still need to see the best of Joseph Parker. Yeah. Well, that's pretty much um I needed to say for right now. Um, please leave your comments below and let me know what you think. Um, and don't forget to subscribe. Once again, this is. Zan the Sportsman TV. Thanks for watching once again, ladies and gents, and I'll see you soon.